all Bitcoin holders, all crypto holders right now are really happy. I was able to sleep, but I'm sure many of you weren't. And while I was in bed, the price of Bitcoin broke to a new all-time high in the last 365 days, almost $46,000. We're almost closer to that Bitcoin ETF first application approval. Guess who? finally decided to fall to Bitcoin. Well, you're seeing him right now on the screen. How many times we heard Jim Cramer speak negatively, bearishly about hawkish about Bitcoin, saying it's fought, it's scammers, the SEC is going to ban it, um, all those things, right? Well, this was a remarkable comeback expected a technological marble and more people should recognize it right now it is what he said and michael saylor one hour ago says it's a reality so you can kill it you can't kill it that's what gene kramer is saying right now oh what an opportunist right what a time for him to say that obviously wants all the favor but what i'll tell you everybody what we've been doing for a while, accumulating DCA is paying off. Let me go ahead and tell you the latest because we are going to go higher. $50,000 Bitcoin is ahead. Whether it's a sell the news event, whether it's a buy the news event, we are just going to break breaking the resistance levels and it's going to get much better. Don't forget to smash like button. Everybody consider subscribing to the channel. Turn on those notification bells because we're happy. As you are actually seeing that chart on CNBC, flat. Pump. That was 2021, 2022, the collapse, 2023, the recovery, 2024 and five. That's going to be the next bull market passing us $100,000. But the question is, are you ready? Now, the market right now is $1.74 trillion. I mean, just the fact that I woke up today and the market is still at 45000 speaks volumes. Because typically, you would have been already back at $43,000. In a normal scenario when it pumps and dumps but it means that people are not willing to sell because they know big things are just going to happen right now and we could have some massive uh, you know sell the news candles but as of now people are holding and we like that now i've been saying this for a while right i think if you look at the previous cycles you know the 2006, 17, the 2020, and then finally 2024, 2025, we still have to pass halving. What I heard yesterday in a live, when I was looking and doing my research with you, is that the Bitcoin ETF approval can give us a nice rally, passing $50,000, but the Bitcoin halving can give us the sell-off that everybody's talking about. And I like that a lot. And I have it here I need to go to my likes. And I'm going to find it for you. It should be somewhere here. I believe here. This is the one. Don't think it will be a sell the news event. Rather than an in before the news event, the approval is going to give us a nice rally. However, the sell the news is going to be the halving. This is the one that is going to be kind of coming crashing down. And it kind of makes sense, right? Why? Because you need a correction before the bull market. That's what always been going on so far. It's important that we understand that. What this person is saying is that right now as 2024 comes in, we are going to probably have a massive God candle that's going to take us to, to the moon. And the, what it's implying is that before or by the halving, we're going to have a massive correction. It's, our, it's all, only speculation, right? I'm just telling you guys what I can, I mean, in a way... I see it as possible. Um, there's 12 spot Bitcoin ETF applications right now, ranging from Grayscale all the way to Franklin. These are all billion and trillion level asset managers, everybody. Just to give you an idea how much money right now is coming in and flowing. Um, it's going to be representing all of us. And well, you better be ready because trading is going to be crazy. Fees are going to be crazy. Exchanges are going to make a lot of money. And I want you all to make a lot of money too. Now, this is the way it's happening. Um, and we've been here since basically a fire sale when we were at the blue level. Finally, we have been able to break that one, then buy and accumulate. I'm going to get closer, and you will see that we're now very close to the still cheap 
So if you're buying Bitcoin because you've been buying it since $15,000 like me, then I think you are in a great position to make good money. Not financially free money, since the people who are going to be really financially free through Bitcoin is this guy, Michael Saylor, because he owns so many, so much. And I think lately he's been giving us some updates as far as how much he's been buying, right? But the thing is, yes, they can ease. Here it is. This was posted on the 27th, an additional 615 million at an average price of 42,000. So he's already making money on that. Because if you can't have all those millions to buy Bitcoin, yes, you're going to be financially free. But like us, I think you're much better. Like I told you in the live, you, you know, have an array. I, we had an array of different altcoins positions that you are putting in your money in. Because that's where us, the this wave of investors are going to be making our major kicks. And it's going to be changing for the upcoming, uh, you know, cycles and holdings as we continue moving on. But for us, Bitcoin is going to be the catalyst. So more altcoins come in and destroy the expectations, everybody. So still cheap and hold this to be coming in, hopefully, by the halving. So we'll be looking at, let me just give you an idea. Anywhere from $40,000 to $60,000 or $40,000 to $60,000 in the next three, four months. I think that's, that's good. I mean, you have three, four months adding $20,000 to the price of Bitcoin. I'll take it. Obviously, we can have some rejections, but I think that's not bad at all. Looking at the bullish momentum we have right now. So anything can happen. I also wanted to give you a nice golden nugget when it comes to altcoins that are running. And this one is inside Kronos, METF, a combined effort by MM, MM Finance. And uh, they're running right now like crazy. You know how I feel about Kronos and Crypto.com. Make sure you get your Crypto.com account right now, link down below. And also up to $5,000 on Binx. Take a look at the link down below as well. Everyone. So... It's going to be pretty interesting to witness the massive fifth wave indeed if they play out like this because 2023 has been doing a really nice baseline for us to start the massive jump in the Bitcoin bull market. Once Bitcoin ends, it's going to transfer to Ethereum. Once that Ethereum ends, it's going to transfer to the major altcoins. That's where your Shiba Inu, your XRP, your Kronos come in. Once that ends, going to transfer to the Alcon season, so it's going to open up the floodgates. And once again, FOMO insanity is going to come in. So couldn't be more ready. Thanks for watching, everybody. Like and subscribe if you want to see more of this. And I'll see you next time. Jim Kramer, JP Morgan, CEO, they're all now with us. Who else is going to be? Oh, not many. Be ready. Billions and trillions are coming. Peace.